Hi everyone and welcome back and if you're new here, hi, welcome, join the enthusiasm, subscribe. In today's video, I am going to review the L'Oreal Rouge Signature Matte Liquid Lipsticks. L'Oreal sent me 12 shades and I'm so thankful for that and uh, I will be reviewing these lipsticks and I will be swatching these. In case you're here just for the swatches, you can check out the description box. So I have got all the shades except one which is I Radiate, which is the shade number 132. Now they also launched six new sunset shades which are inspired by sunset and I think I Radiate is one of them. These lipsticks are obviously available on Nike and they retail for rupees 650 for 7 ml of product so first of all let's come to the packaging of these lipsticks I love the packaging you guys especially the doe food applicator it's so good and it's got a really nice angle to it which I really love that makes the application really very easy now the lipstick comes in a frosted tube obviously it looks really nice and sturdy and it feels really good the packaging is also very much travel friendly the cap is very much secure and and it closes on a like tuck sound. Now let's come to the pigmentation. I will definitely be rating the pigmentation of each and every shade in the swatch part of the video. But overall these shades are really very pigmented. Right now the shade that I have on is 126 Eye Play. Now these lipsticks are going to cover the pigmentation of your lips in case you have pigmented lips like I have. Most of the shades have got one swipe pigmentation. Now let's come to the formulation and how it feels on the lips. This lipstick is insanely comfortable you guys. You cannot feel like literally cannot feel that you have matte liquid lipstick on your lips. These are not patchy at all. The application is really even. Now that might vary with some shades and I will actually mention that if it happens in the swatches. And this is actually a unique oil in water kind of a formula. So obviously it feels like that when you apply it. It feels really cooling and then later on it kind of settles into matte. It's not actually completely matte. Like you can see it's not completely powder matte now it takes almost five to ten minutes to completely settle on your lips and uh uh, to become almost transfer proof and also kind of matte as you can see right now now it will stay for at least stay down on your lips but it will fade if you eat something very oily and uh, in fact if you have a meal it will kind of fade the darker shades will leave you with a tint now it's pretty much smudge proof and it's also kind of transfer proof as you can see there is a little bit of transfer but nothing insane actually the brand claims that this lipstick has got no flaking obviously i agree with that there is no flaking or it won't settle in your fine lines and all of that and plus it's non tacky as you can see it's completely non tacky then second thing is no smudging obviously it's almost smudge proof if not 100% it is almost like 90% smudge proof once it settles down completely for which it takes almost 10 minutes I would say so after that if you try to smudge this lipstick it won't smudge now the next thing is that there is no drying out obviously it doesn't dry out my lips I have very dry lips now the smudging kind of also depends on your lips my lips are very dry therefore this lipstick is not like almost smudge proof um, this can destroy my whole makeup if it smudges but yes let's test it out I'm trying to smudge it but it's not smudging obviously if you get a very hard push it will smudge most of the lipsticks do I think but yes it's almost smudge proof and that is how I tested it now the pigmentation is great the formula is great the staying power is great also I like how it feels on my lips so I actually like this lipstick and I think you get what you're paying for so I hope that this review was helpful for you and now let's head to the swatches 